Hey folks, it's Anne Marie from LSU CXC, and thanks for spending part of your day with me. Today I'm going to talk to you a little bit about some of the studio resources and student recognition opportunities that are available to you through LSU CXC. But first, I'll answer this probably really vital question in your mind. Why communication? Why when there are so many things out there that are appropriate and important for you to focus on, would there be a program like LSU CXC that focuses singularly on helping you develop your communication skills? The answer is actually quite simple. Communication is the 21st century skill. Regardless of your major, regardless of the path that you're taking, regardless of what you're doing today and how it may or may not connect with what you're doing tomorrow or 10 years from now, communication is a skill that can thread success through all of those life experiences. And it's not just us that feels that way. The Association of American Colleges and Universities did a study in 2013 concluding that 93% of employers say a demonstrated capacity to think critically, communicate clearly, and solve complex problems is more important than a candidate's major. Now, obviously, if you want to be an engineer, it's probably a good idea to major in engineering. But the reality is, for so many of us, our paths are winding. And what we expect today might be different from what we experience tomorrow. And what we do with a major today might actually have really powerful implications and positive impacts for something 10 or even 20 years from now that we can't even conceive of right now. So communication can be something that helps you propel through all of those new and different opportunities. And it's not just the AAC and you that says this. The National Association of Colleges and Employers defines career readiness. They are a national standard that identifies the skill sets that undergraduate students should hopefully be developing while they're going through their classes and completing their degrees. And they identify oral and written communication, digital technology, professionalism and work ethic, teamwork and collaboration, critical thinking and problem solving as some of the top competencies or skill sets that you should be developing for yourself in the here and now while you're taking your classes as an undergraduate. That's where we come in. At a baseline level, at our CXC studio, sort of on the ground, regardless of what classes you're in, regardless of what major you're in, the CXC studios are available for you to help you build out your communication skills. Now, we have three on-site locations on our main campus in Baton Rouge. One is in the Art and Design Building, in the Design Building 104. One is in the Chevron Center in Patrick F. Taylor 1269, and one is in Studio 151, which is inside Coates Hall. But we also have a slew of digital resources available for you in the here and now, accessing them from your device anywhere. What we focus on at the CXC Studios is really about multimodal communication. So a lot of folks think of us as um, first and foremost writing support, and we do offer that for you. Um, but what we do is we also connect you with opportunities to enhance your skills and things like podcasting, whether it's storyboarding and oral articulation or the process of recording and editing audio and video too, we do it for. We also provide one-on-one -on -one mentoring services in writing and oral communication and visual design. And we also do consultations if you're using technology to do things like build websites or cultivate some other technological communication skill. We help you with your presentations, whether it's the visuals or the oral delivery of it. And we can help you with other things too, like photo documentation, 3D printing, and visualization consultation support services, and a whole slew of other things. So stay up to date for our site-specific and digital resources via cxc.lsu.edu. Now, you might be watching this video because you're sitting in something called a communication intensive course. And let's say you heard about these studios, you use these resources, and you want something more. And you also want to get some recognition for this hard work that you're putting in cultivating your communication skills. That's where these recognition programs come into place. And we have two for you. The first is the LSU Communicator Certificate. So like I said, you might be sitting in a CI course at this very moment. And if you get a B minus or higher in that class, you're already taking steps to complete the certificate. We ask you to do this in three writing mode courses, two speaking mode courses, one visual mode course, and one technological mode course, which sounds like a lot, but don't panic. It's actually not as much as you think, because a three credit course can count as two modes. 
In addition to doing your CI courses, we'll ask you to do a written reflection. That's your opportunity to really sit and think about everything that you've done in these CI courses, and particularly the communication skills you've developed in them, and how they're valuable, how you intend to use them in the world that you're going to encounter after graduation. So you do those two things, and then you graduate with it. And a lot of questions we get are, what's the deadline to apply for the concert? And the good news is there's no real deadline. You're going to receive an email update from LSU CXC showing you your progress toward the certificate. And then students who complete the course requirements and submit the reflection before the due date in their final semester are in the concert. So that's it. Your B minus or higher in communication intensive courses plus your written, uh, your written reflection equals success. But let's say you want more. I wouldn't blame you. It's nice to know that you're cultivating skills, right? So we also have a program called the LSU Distinguished Communicator Medal. And this entails completion of everything for the communicator certificate, but also a successful completion and review of the ePortfolio under the guidance of your CXE representative and a faculty advisor. So this is really an opportunity for you to identify a faculty member that you really feel like you can learn from and who's gonna invest time to give you feedback on your professional development path, helping you figure out what's working for you and how to customize and articulate all of these skills that you've been building in a public facing website for the audience that you're trying to connect with after you graduate. And then you're probably asking, why does a portfolio matter? Isn't a resume enough? Isn't a cover letter enough? And those things are very important. They are very important, and hear me when I say that. But we also know that 81% of hiring managers say that e-portfolios are more useful than a resume and transcript alone in identifying a candidate's potential. Because in that e-portfolio, you have an opportunity to control the narrative about who you are and really make sure that you are representing yourself and how you are uniquely equipped, uniquely awesome, and obviously the best candidate for whatever it is that you are applying to. And after that, when you complete all those things, you move through the portfolio review, you become a medalist, and you get the LSU concert, you get a transcript notation that says not only did you get your degree, but you are also a distinguished communicator, and then you get a cool medal at graduation, but most importantly, you have communication skills for life. So when you're ready to connect with us, whether it is on your journey for the Distinguished Communicator Medal Program, or it's about visiting us in the studios, remember that we're here for you. And when you wanna know what the deadline is for applying to be a part of the Distinguished Communicator Program, here's your info right here. Students with at least three semesters left are encouraged to apply. And this is because we wanna give you time to connect with your faculty advisor and to develop your portfolio materials. So come and see us in the CXC studios, digitally or on site for some appointment-based resources, check back at CXC. But what we offer you is writing support, presentation support, 3D and 2D resources and consultations, AV equipment checkouts, and a lot more. So like I said, stay up to date on resources at cxc.lsu.edu. Take care of yourselves and happy communicating.